What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah, if you don't know, and if you do, hey, welcome. Welcome back. What's up? How you doing? Um, for today's video, I wanted I wanted to revamp like this video that I ended up making almost a year ago now. If you've been around for a while, you know I've been on YouTube now for a year. Well, I had made like a vlog style period slash sick day self like routine. Um, I'll leave that linked up there for you. I do believe it's going to be this corner. And basically, it's a video I still get views today. Um, it was very thrown together. I was only making videos maybe for a month. I wasn't feeling good, so it was more of a vlog style. Today, I wanted to make this is like a self care routine, like pamper routine. Personally, I find it really important to take care of your mental health, know your boundaries, when you need to take a personal day versus when you know you would be okay for another day. I know I struggle with depression and anxiety really bad. I don't really try and let that stop me. I tend to overwork myself and push myself until I physically like fall over asleep. What I do to kind of help myself when I know I need to focus on myself and care for myself. If you are wondering how I take care of myself and pamper myself, go ahead and keep on watching. So the first thing that I do, one, is to get out of the cute clothes and into some comfy clothes. All right, so I just threw on my um, s and sweatshirt and then some leggings because comfy clothes are literally the best thing. It makes you mentally feel better and like that's what I look forward to when I come home like from work or running errands all day is coming home, changing to something I'm super comfortable in. Hi. Oh, my baby. Um, that is step number one. Literally, I bet, I promise you, your day will be. I promise you will feel 10 times better. The next thing I do to help myself, like, is I want to take time to myself. If you're like me, I live in a house with a lot of people, whether that's roommates, your family, which for me, it's my family right now. I like to take the time by myself where I know nobody will bother me and that's in the bathroom. Typically this is where I take a bath and I'll just relax, I'll sit in there and read, listen to a podcast, I'll do a face mask, play with makeup, do pretty much whatever girly thing I, you think you can do in the bathroom and do it where nobody's gonna bother me. So the next thing we're gonna do is wash your face, put a little bit of a face mask on, we're gonna get the skin looking good because right now she a little dry, she a little dirty, and we're gonna put a face mask on and relax. While I'm washing my face and putting it on, I'm gonna go ahead and start the bath. I love bubble baths, I love bath bombs in them, I love putting Epsilon salts to help relax, reach yourself, make it fancy. If you want, light some candles and relax in candlelight. Like, turn the lights off, relax, close your eyes. So soothing. Personally, I'll light one candle, like one big smelly candle from like Bath and Body Works. I'll read the book that I'm reading. Like that's the time I get to myself. I can do what I enjoy and I love reading books. Um, so that's what I'll do and I'll sit in there about, and I'll sit in there for about almost an hour, like up to an hour, hour and a half. For myself personally, like the best thing is not really be on technology. I'll turn on a show, I'll hang out with Blaine, we'll just sit on the couch with a cat, I'll paint my nails, and we're gonna watch our favorite show, which right now is Supernatural. And like I said, might paint my nails. Typically he likes to paint my nails, so I'll let him do it. But I'll go ahead and clip my nails, file them down, especially if they need it, um, and then brush my hair. The best feeling is when somebody else's brushes your hair like literally comment down below if you agree with me like whenever so whenever someone like brushes it plays with it run their fingers through it, it is like, <laughs> best feeling is to have like your hair ran through and played with and so typically I'll like beg Blaine to do it and he'll do it for me 
So brush my hair, put it up in like a ponytail or something, and then literally the rest of the night, I'm off the phone, I'm off homework, I don't want to think about Calculus 3 because it's Calculus 3. And like I said, I'll just sit on the couch for the rest of the night, relax, and just kind of mentally shut everything off and not even think about it. So, alright guys, so if you stayed with me this long, thank you. And I hope you do take some of these tips and uh, things that I do, put it into your routine. Comment down below like what you do to relax and self-care and pamper yourself with, whether that's buying your favorite ice cream, eating ice cream, or like I said, taking an hour long bath and literally being by yourself and refuse to listen to anybody else and just taking it to, will you stop? <laughs> <laughs> okay, <I'm done. laughs> whether that's taking an hour long bath and just not listening to anybody and taking that time literally just for yourself to be in your own little bubble, like, just make sure you take care of yourself, as always. Taking other care of people, taking care of other people is important, but it's always, always more important to check in with yourself every once in a while and make the decision to take care of yourself as well. So, as always, thank you for watching. Don't forget the like button, comment down below, and as always, subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! I hate you. <laughs> Between him and you, I want to cry.